belonging. It's warmth, it's being nurtured when you're down, it's laughter, it's unconditional love. It's a roller coaster of emotions and at the end of the day, you know you've always got something to come home to. For years, I didn't feel comfortable who I was as a person and sometimes I couldn't understand why I couldn't be comfortable with who I am. You've changed my life for the better. i finally been able to express myself for who I really am. My family were always uh, so accepting of myself when I came out to them about my sexuality. And, but then when I met Kara, it was an, a new sense of belonging. I love the way you look at me. I love the way you make me feel. I love the way your support, love and drive is unconditional. I was quite raw to the game and I heard a lot about this so-called Juddy and um, I thought, oh, well, who's this Juddy girl? She came across quite arrogant, a bit cocky and it just kind of sparked my interest a little bit. I wanted to get to know her a bit more and to be honest, yeah, when of course, I... look at it. <laughs> she used to call me a wet lettuce, that I wasn't very interesting and was always in no, bed by about 8.30. <laughs> We've got very similar values and and I suppose the drive in which we want to be better each and every day is what I fell in love with. You know, ever since the start, we've clicked. I think from the moment that we've met each other, we felt like we were meant to be. And don't get me wrong, we bring out the best and the worst of each other, but I think that's all part of being in a relationship and now obviously being married. <laughs> <laughs> oh, what, you disagree? No, I don't agree. I agree. <laughs> So myself and Kara decided that um, we were going to have our nanas be our witnesses and um, we decided to make it a surprise on the day so they had no idea. A little bit more special with my nan because she was currently going through breast cancer. I said, come on nan, come up with me and I started tearing up and she started tearing up and obviously the generation back then when they were about our age, it wasn't accepting to have gay marriages or anything like that so to have them both up there and be so accepting of us was fantastic and that's Pretty much the last memory I have of my nan because um, she passed away when we were on our honeymoon and a quote that I go by that everything happens for a reason and I feel like she was hanging on um, to witness our marriage and then she couldn't fight it anymore and let go and um, yeah it was it was a difficult time for myself and Cara. I suppose it just shows how the generational shift is occurring. When I came out my nan said to me I'll love you no matter what. Nan was a fantastic role model for me. I just hope that whatever I do in the footy field, I'm making her proud. I grew up uh, with a single single mum and my old surname was linked to my dad and I didn't have much to do with him up until the age of probably about nine. It was a new start of a new kind of chapter for ourselves and our own family and I think that surname was the last thing connecting me to that part of my life and couldn't be more prouder to to have Antonio as my surname, it's, it's something that now, I suppose, connects us both even more and being the first ever married couple to play AFL together is, is obviously something really, really special as well. Cara Antonio leads Fremantle out. Obviously, football brought Ebony and I together. We wouldn't have crossed paths if it wasn't for that. So I'm very fortunate. Again, the game brings ups and downs, but I think the positives and what I've got from the game is obviously a wife and many, many best friends. I love our little family we've created here, myself and Juddy, and then our three little fur babies. Just makes that all more enjoyable to know that, you know, every single event that we get to go to or every single game, we get to walk out together and be proud of each other and um, know that we'll back each other in. At the end of the day, we don't take any of this for granted. Whether we win, lose or draw, we're, we're doing it together and I think that's what's so special and, and makes our relationship work and we're loving every second of it.